I am emotionally, mentally, physically, everything exhausted and Hey, welcome to another day in the life vlog. That's Olivia right back there playing. Um, we just filmed a review for this play mat right here. Um, and my baby hairs are flying high today. Uh, but I thought I would take you along with me on a normal day. My kids have been misbehaving a lot lately. It has been almost exactly four months since my husband deployed. We kind of got into the groove of things. And in all honesty, it's been very difficult on me. Um, a few weeks ago, it kind of really hit me. Well, I was driving to the commissary for some reason, and I started crying my eyes out because I miss my husband so much. I'm gonna try not to talk about it too much because it makes me cry. But um, my husband and I have been together for almost 10 years, and um, not married 10 years, but together 10 years. And we are far from perfect. We never want to act like we're perfect because we know that we're not. We have a lot of problems that we work through and need to work through. But um, regardless, we still choose each other. And um, I miss him so much. I didn't think it was going to hit me like out of nowhere, especially after it's been a few months already. And I know that we're almost halfway through, but still, it's been a long four months. Luckily enough, my mom is going to come stay with us for a little bit um really soon and um we're excited to have nana come and visit us and i am excited to have company and a break because doing it all is not easy i am not a single mom and even though i am alone right now um i still have my husband who i can talk to obviously we are not in the best situation where I can just pick up the phone and call him and vent or tell him what great things Olivia has been learning um, but still I know that he's there and he will be here soon and that this will pass uh, for all you single moms that maybe are watching this um, you are tough because I cannot imagine not having uh, the support of my husband even though right now we are alone I know that it's temporary and that at some point we will be together again and you know it makes it bearable you know I, I know that I have my spouse who is there to back me up to help me to comfort me to annoy me <laughs> but he's there and he's in my child's life and even though right now we are struggling and making it through the day um, at some point He'll be with us and we will be a family together. For those of you that don't know, I was an army brat, so I thought that I had a leg up on this thing. <laughs> but no, it's so different because um, as a child, you, you have your parents no matter what. Um, you might miss where you were or the people you met or your friends or your family, but you have your parents all the time. Um, but when you're the mom it's so much different and it's lonely it's very lonely it's lonely and it's scary because you know your husband is at war and you don't know what could happen so it's very stressful and um this is our first deployment and you know, hopefully there won't be more, but that's what my husband trains for and works for is to serve his country. So um, I just pray that God keeps him safe <laughs> and that hopefully there aren't much more deployments, if any, in the future because this has been super difficult. I am just emotional. I did say that I would share the good and the bad and lately it's 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 been super difficult. I've My kids have been, um, been misbehaving and being toddlers and growing and getting jealous and I have been losing my patience and it's just a lot. It's a lot when you have everything on your plate, it's it's very difficult and um, you know, I think that it's good for me to put this out even if just for me um, because as I said before, I know that not everyone is interested in these type of videos and it's okay, I get it. For most of us parents who watch other parents, <laughs> um, their vlogs and their day in the lives, it's good to see how different each of our lives are even though we are all we are all taking care of our little ones everything is so different everyone is so different every child is so different so i 
I don't know, I just like documenting some of this craziness that is being alone um, with three children. So I'm gonna go downstairs right now and get this little baby down for a nap. For some reason, when she's sleepy, her eyes look even bigger, but sleepy. Hey, Olivia, can you give that to mama? And if you want to see what it looks like to film with your baby, take a look at this. Those are all of the toys that my daughter insists on having a certain way so she can take a nap or go to bed. And today is actually Memorial Day and um, yesterday I cleaned all three bathrooms, discovered a leak, did all of the laundry for all four of us, folded it and put it away. And um, I cleaned the floor downstairs but I do that every day so it's... I am emotionally, mentally, physically, everything exhausted and for me to endure the rest of deployment i think i need this break because i'm just falling apart <laughs> lately i am just falling apart and i feel like the more that i want to do for my kids the more it just blows up in my face so i am ready for an extra set of hands around here Anyway, I'm just gonna have some lunch and then I will check in a little bit later. I think that um, what we're gonna do later is give all three kids a bath. So obviously you saw that Olivia is awake now. Um, as soon as I sat down to start to eat, she woke up. So yeah, that's just how my life is, right baby girl? Um, and my daughter fell asleep right away. She is fast asleep and my son is still playing around um, and it's been about 40 minutes. Okay, oh, you don't want your bowl, okay. Pretty. Huh? So I'm just gonna hang out with her. I already ate so I am feeling a little bit more alive. <laughs> 
I feel like I need another coffee, though. Ma. Mm -hmm. Ma. 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 Can you show your purse? Wow. What's that? Baby. It's pretty. So they get fell asleep. The sun. And now we're gonna give the big kids a bath. Here she goes. Hi, Dad. Hey. You want to take a bath? Okay. Okay. So what I've been doing is, um, even if they don't take a nap, they have to stay in the room and have quiet time where they play um, quietly <laughs> in their bed or with their toys, whatever they want. They can come downstairs but not right away because I need them to rest in. Again, I need my time. Yes. It's pretty. I'm gonna get, whoa, that's bright. I'm gonna give my kids a bath and then all I have to do is really make their food and give Olivia a bath later because I already cooked my food yesterday and all I have to do is heat it up. You wanna go pee pee? Okay. My dinner it's right there and it's so good it's from home chef and it's delicious um, all three of my kids already ate and my two oldest already had their bath so um, I only need to have my dinner and then give Olivia a bath and then it's just playtime until it's time to bed time for bed
It's 7.20 now, so I am really ending the vlog now because I gave Olivia her bath and now everyone is in their PJs. And in about 20 minutes, I am gonna start taking them for their last potty trip and then up the stairs to go to bed, finally. That's been our day today. It's been pretty smooth. I hope that this is gonna turn out okay because I've just rambled a lot today and I don't know how long it's gonna be and I don't like long videos. I don't mind watching them when it's someone that I really like, but I don't like making long videos because I feel like no one's gonna watch them. But anyway, if it turns out okay and you're watching this and you enjoyed it, show me with a thumbs up. And if you like this channel and aren't a subscriber, consider subscribing by clicking the button and if you haven't, click that little bell because that helps YouTube remind you when any video is now live. So thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you again soon. Bye.